So you gotta eat, honey. Yeah. You're gonna be so hungry. Yeah. Please. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> These frozen? They're too cold. Watch this, watch this. <laughs> you missed it. Marlene, could you help me a little? Yes, darling. <gasps> Is it food for me? Oh, uh, no. We have people coming over. Oh, oh my god. Oh, wait, wait, do this one. Do okay. shrimp salad. Honey, where are you? Don't tell them I stuck my fingers in the food. Anybody home? Mom? Yeah. I'm just setting up for lunch. Hi, sweetie. Uh, this is the only woman I know who dresses up to clean. <laughs> I know, I know. She looks great. I know. She looks amazing. I'm I am. I'll put it in oh, my Oh, thank you. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Ma, Jen's coming over with her mother and her mother's twin sister. They're crazy like you. Oh, that works. Lean on my shoulder, Aunt Cassie. Wait, we're doing it at a time? Oh, like you oh, can't God. handle this, Mom. Oh, oh, we're like it's a, We're telling like it's a treadmill, OK? Oh, God. I'll leave you upstairs. OK, you go upstairs. <laughs> I'm so excited for you guys. Oh, oh, my God. God. I'm so glad you did. Oh, okay, and Cassie. Okay. My mom is an identical twin. Her name is Marilyn, and my grandmother named her twin Carolyn. And they love being twins. To this day, they're 80 years old, and they're dressing alike. Oh, this looks just like my apartment. No, a little smaller. Stop it. Oh, my God. You two are oh, the best. This way, this is Mark Senior. Hi. 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 They were born in Brooklyn, where they were best friends with Barbara Streisand. Just gonna drop that in. Carolyn. Carolyn. And Marilyn is Jennifer's mother. Barbara Streisand used to go to my mom and my aunt's house, and my grandmother would play piano, and Barbara Streisand would sing. Do you guys want wine, water? What can I give you? Water. Oh, for, water. Are we having to eat this now? Yeah. They're like, she will have lunch, right, Jen? But, but you know what this house yes. doesn't have? What? Plates. Yeah. <laughs> Plates. Oh. 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 oh! I mean, I have never seen two whirling dervishes like this in my life. OK, so, what's this yellow? That's a coconut. Oh, uh, that's not. No. I have more. 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 <laughs> now I know where Fessler gets it from. Do you guys live near each other? We're 15 minutes apart. Yes. That's so nice. And do your husbands get along? Yes, they get along. Well, her husband's, what, 104? Really? Really? Jennifer. Is that bad to say 94? You said 104. I could have said 74. They wouldn't have known. Do you have anybody from Art Senior? She needs a boyfriend. You don't want to get married. No. no. Oh, God. Oh, please. <laughs> I couldn't stand being with somebody 24 hours a day. No. Well, I'm married to a stage five clinger. He's obsessed with her. How many years you married? Well, this is my second husband. Okay. Was he divorced as well? We both left our, our spouses for each other. Oh, oh, okay. I get that. It happens. Yeah, right. Talk to me. Mm hmm mm hmm Yes, it does. I was three years old when my parents got divorced, and they couldn't be more different. My mother is kooky and an extrovert, and my father is very serious. So they both remarried, and then there was more divorce. With family, it's complicated. So that was a roller coaster, for sure. There are four girls, right? So they each have two girls. So we're all like sisters. She was always a very loving mother, but she had a lot to deal with. And as a result, I moved around quite a bit. And my aunt and cousins were still living on Long Island. So it was really hard because we were sort of like, you know, one family. Like, my aunt is my second mother. Yes, of course. Oh, of course. So it's like we have a special bond. No matter what happened, my aunt was always a constant. We're very lucky like that. Yeah. And my kids live for them. I love them to death. The oh, best thing is to be a grandparent. You, you're yeah. obsessed? You're obsessed. He's 26 now, so, you know, he's got this wonderful life. And she also, and she is, Lexi has a little son, Nino. So you're with him all the time. Wow, that is very special. She's like my sister. She's been with me 14 years. She runs no, my they're company. Partners, She's they work partners, together, they work together. Friends. She was with you in Ireland. No, yeah. I was just telling the twins about Ireland. Did everybody get along? Well, that's not no, exaggerated. I mean, a, no. <laughs> is there a nasty bitch in the group? There's an immature I'm asshole. What, the what's beginning. her name? Her name is Danielle. Yes. She's a nice girl, but she's going through something with her brother. Oh. She was just, every time Melissa and Teresa, you know, they have their own issues. They would friends. talk about their issues. Oh my God, this reminds me of my problems. Oh, and start crying, like back to her. Everything was like a drama. She you has know, issues. Mm-hmm. Danielle is used to being the center of attention probably in her family. And she's very much, look at me, look at me, look at me. But 
everything's not about you. I felt sorry for her for one second, and I was trying to coddle her a little bit, but this girl attacked me. I know that. It's just awkward when we're all together. So that was like a little tricky at our friend Teresa's wedding shower. And it's always kind of a little weird because her and her sister-in-law, our friend Melissa, they don't get yeah, along. And I'm they so don't close get with Melissa. No. It's been years and years yeah. and years. And, of and it hasn't worked. Teresa's always saying, all I want is family to be together. But then she wasn't included in the shower. No. OK. She does things like this. And, and Melissa was like, why do I want this? So is Melissa going to go to the wedding? I hope so. Ah, oh, Dolores. Oh, you're looking hotter every time I see you. Stop. Maybe crushed the car. I was looking at you all the way down. You were? Yeah. Oh, my god. Good evening. Welcome. Hi, Catania. Right over here. Thank you. Italians never sit with their back to the door. I was watching for the hitman coming in. Yo, yo, yo. Why, what, are we in a rush? No, you guys just walk slow. Oh, my god. I'm a little nervous. You're a good sport. You are. Frank wanted to have this dinner celebrating Frankie's dream job with just the four of us. However, Paul is now part of our family dynamic. And this is how I want it to be. Hi, family. Oh, they're here. Yay. And I know Frank likes to bust balls, and sometimes things get carried away. Hey, what's up? Good to see you. What's up, brother? Frankie, good to see you, man. But nobody busts balls more than an Irishman. How you good feeling? Job. I'm feeling good, man. How you feeling? Oh, uh, OK. What's up, right. man? What's going on? Good. Jersey Shore crowd. Yeah. Why don't you guys come down? Yeah. He yeah. hates the shore. Yeah. I'm almost feeling like Paulie doesn't want to be in the same room with me. But more than anything, I want this dinner where Paulie sees the relationship between Dolores and I when we're all together. And he will accept us, and our family can go back to the way it used to be.